As the month of June comes to a close, an extended Juneteenth celebration was held at Simpson Park. My Mitchell shares how the person who the park is named after was honored this afternoon. It feels like we're standing on hallowed ground and the people that came before us kind of made the trail and we're just kind of following in it. Marnita Simpson Shepherd is a descendant of James Elias Simpson, who the park is named after. Yeah, Mr. Simpson, this, his house was on this land and um, it went through his family and then it became a park. And we just want to honor his family and his legacy and just really uplift the community. He was a merchant. Um, he owned acres and acres of land, including, of course, where we're standing on right now today. He was um, a philanthropist and he just was very helpful with helping his community out. Until this year, there was no signage to tell Mr. Simpson's story of who he was to the community. It was named Simpson Park, but you know people really didn't know who he was and who he is. So we're taking care of that today. Now there are these two signs in the park, detailing Mr. Simpson's history and his family tree. People are going to know now who he is. We hope that this is a welcoming space for people to come out and just learn about the history of the community. The bench is new and we're going to have a little sitting area around the historical signs so people can read and reflect. For the Simpson family, it was overwhelming to see the work of their ancestors still carrying on today. They hope his legacy will continue to impact generations to come. We're actually setting the groundwork for the youngsters coming behind us. I hope they come through and read about his history and realize it's that this is a community, that none of this happened because of one person or two people or three people. Amaya Mitchell, 29 News.